So you definitely see tomahawks, and they're launching missiles at them. And let's switch back to the other side. I don't want to keep getting a... Uh... Wow, what are these? So these uh these gladiators way over here are able to fire uh, counter missiles to c to cover this area, so I don't think this strike is actually going to be as successful as I uh as I think it is. Let's see, B ones are still inbound. The second missile stream is uh is coming in, and let's start ordering these guys to uh their attacks. So this group here, you take out that. This group, that group. This group will go after the uh, the Growler. And we'll send this group after the Growler as well. And how are the B1s? B1s are still Skirting the outskirts. More missiles incoming. These are probably growlers. Probably going for the B1s. So let's pause here. What's their weapons range? So these guys should be within weapons range now. So order these guys to... Uh, Attack there. Go after the fleet base. And we'll have this group actually just turn right on in so they can start firing. There we go. Turn them on to bearing so they can launch. And that is a lot of, that's more. Look at these guys just ripple fire, ripple fire those jasms. So even if uh, these missiles take out one or two bombers, there's still going to be a massive wave of uh, missiles inbound. And as soon as these guys are done firing, they've got four more. Let's just get these guys to break off or turn home. Um, let's see, how, how are these guys looking over here? These guys shouldn't have many missiles left either. 39. Actually, get these guys. Even if they have missiles left, I don't want to get too close. I don't want to get them any closer. So I think all these guys are gonna start turning now. Start returning home. And just an absolute another wave of a uh, massive wave of uh, jasms. I'm gonna start losing B1. Gonna lose a lot more B1s though, but um, I don't know. Let's go look and see how many missiles the. I don't think the BB that BBG has anything left. I think at this point it's uh, it's fired itself out. Um, believe it or not, it it only yeah actually it only has land attack standard missiles which I don't think have the range. The B1s are still trying to break off, losing some more. But uh, 
think quite a few of these guys are actually going to make it make it out of there. Let this guy return to base. Yeah, that's a lot of missiles. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I think uh I think the only thing uh the only launcher that didn't launch was just the standard missiles in the uh in the one VLSL. I'm pretty sure in this one scenario, I pretty much shot through the entire U.S. inventory of uh, Tomahawk missiles. And I don't seem to be losing many, uh, many of these jasms. These things don't seem to be disappearing. So maybe I've ran those growlers out of missiles. like to go up to like 15, 15 times speed but it's just making this it's this scenario is already running really slow 1822 unit count at the moment from all the missiles although it should drop significantly when uh as these missiles start going off oh which reminds me switch back to the other side Ooh. merge rain symbols for this side too um i forgot i had Bombers. And I actually don't think I ever launched the, uh, the, ba the, uh, oh no, those are the backfires. Where are my, uh, did I ever launch the, uh, nope, I didn't launch, I didn't launch the blackjacks. They've got 40 seconds till they can launch. I guess let's just get the bare D's over here. Uh, eh, it's not going to matter. Uh, just leave them. Let's watch the missile storm. And slowly moving. Things should pick up again here in a couple of uh, seconds after all these are, all this group is off the board. Um, yeah, the backfires actually won't launch. The, uh, the backfires, um, are actually will take another like 16 or 17 hours to uh to, to finish rearming so the backfires are actually stuck on the ground and i could launch the blackjacks but it's not really going to matter they're probably not going to get off the air before these uh jasms uh strike and destroy the runway or their hangars So how'd the E-12s fare? I don't remember. Uh, did these guys... Uh, oh, it looks like they took out a couple of the radar sites. Looks like they're returning to base. Hmm. I don't remember getting very many... many uh, missiles destroy or units destroyed messages so i'm assuming that that strike was somewhat successful oh yeah those blackjacks are are done for i could launch them right now and i don't think they'd actually get uh get airborne
All right, still watching the. Let's see if. Oh, sorry about that. Let's see if I can speed this up. These missiles are just chugging. Uh, let's see if I can turn the normal pulse mode. No, that's not what I want. Yeah, gonna have to turn it back down to five second intervals. 15's not gonna work. 15's just basically lock this up. So it might not have been a good idea to launch so many missiles in in one go, but the results will be worth it. You can see all the uh, how many missiles are allocated to uh, all the sites over here. These missiles over here doing? Oh, those are uh, A12s. Oh, that'll that might speed it up a little bit more. Switching it back to uh, to unit view or back to group view. I mean, and the jasms have started to hit. Took out the radar site over there. And that just slowed this thing to a crawl when the when those went off. Yeah, my pulse time is up to uh almost almost twelve thousand MS. This was probably not a great idea at all, in retrospect. Let's zoom this out more. Actually, I think I just locked up the scenario. I don't think this is actually pulsing at all. There we go. Down to one second. Yeah, I think I just crashed this. I think I have too many units for this to actually calculate anything. Uh, we can always try take off high fidelity mode. Nope. Doesn't look like it made a difference at all. I just have too many uh, missiles on screen right now. So I think this group here, these jasms, we're just going to like, delete those. That'll clear up uh, some. And uh, these radar sites down here, we'll try and get rid of some of these so we can actually uh, hit something. Although I don't, I doubt deleting uh, just the, these few units will actually make that big of a difference, but might do something. Why aren't these guys deleting? And still pulsing. Well, I think uh, I think this is uh, unfortunately I think this is as far as it's going to get. I don't think uh, I think I just launched too many missiles here and actually just uh, just broke the game. Oh no, missiles seem like they're back moving again. No, nope. I think that was just a false hope. Just caught at the right time. Yeah, pulse time is up to uh, is up to fifteen thousand or fourteen thousand ms. So I think uh, 
Um, that's a good idea. Let's see what we can remove from. Uh, well, that's what I. That's the side I just was on. Oh, yeah. I need to be over here. And let's see what. Um, what on this side can I remove? Let's remove all of these radars down here that are outside my strike. But I don't think uh, getting rid of these guys is really going to do much. Um, no, let's get rid of... Problem is, is all of, the, all of these multi-unit air bases over here. Each one of these over here is, isn't just a single unit. All of these is made up of all its individual pieces. Yep, just not enough. Uh, but we can probably get rid of... Let's keep the radar. All right. Well, that freed up a little bit, but I don't think it's actually going to be enough to uh, to make a difference without eliminating all of these units in here. Switch back to the U.S. Yeah. Yeah. No, my that hasn't improved my pulse time at all. So, unfortunately, guys, I well, I can probably I don't really want to delete the the mass amount of missiles because I think that just takes that that'll take away from uh. But what I could do, we can probably get rid of some of them. See happens if we take away some of these, if that improves pulse time at all. Maybe we can get this thing down to somewhat bearable, even if we have to reduce the missile stream. Um, down to 1300 AU, but it's still not really pulsing well. My time is just going up, so unfortunately, guys, I think I'm just going to have to uh, call it here, unfortunately. Um, sorry for uh, just sitting here around for the last 10-15 minutes just trying to get this thing to pulse um, or play. Um, so thanks for everybody for, for joining me today. Um, you can follow me. I stream, uh, I stream Tuesdays at uh, 7 p.m. and I stream Saturdays at 11 a.m. You can definitely expect to see more command. You can follow me at uh, at Kushan Gaming on uh, Twitter and I also have a YouTube uh, a YouTube channel that is linked down in the Twitch that you can uh, find. Um, I've uh, damn I've uh, I've tried restarting and it didn't it hasn't affected. I just have too many units loaded. It's uh, unfortunately not going to uh, to work here. Really sorry for all this. So, like I said, the the link to my YouTube is down below. I'm at Kushan Gaming on Twitter. Um, and thanks again for everyone for joining me. I will uh, see you guys next time.